Morning everyone, it's Derek from 90 Diagnostics. We have a customer's car in the workshop today. Um, it failed its NCT on a rear metal brake pipe uh, corrosion. Um, this car was in with us last week for the service. This is something that we noticed on the car and we reported it to the customer. Um, that along with a few other items. Um, but they decided to put the car in the NCT and see what the NCT found. And lo and behold, they actually found that there was corrosion on the rear brake pipe. Um, you want to be blind to miss this but let's have a look <clears throat> so this is your your driver side rear wheel and now obviously your passenger and um, this is one of the, the brake pipes a little bit of corrosion um, just up here on on that brake pipe and this brake pipe runs all the way down up to a flexible brake pipe and then up to your your reservoir and as you can see just here the, the actual corrosion on that brake pipe it's quite bad um, so we're going to uh, replace the brake pipe, take that old one out, we're going to replace the whole section um, and put a brand new uh, brake pipe into it, um, bleed out um, the brakes, um, top up the fluid and then get the car back to the customer. Um, that's probably one of the easier ones to replace. Some of them, them brake pipes, they run above our um, fuel tanks and they can be quite awkward to do. Um, so if if you've been told that your anything to do with your brakes needs to be done, especially something like that, um, because you've no idea how far that corrosion has gone into um, the brake uh, metal brake pipe, how far it penetrates in, and at some point um, that brake pipe will break, um, and then you lose your your brakes. Your, your foot pedal will go to the floor, um, and um, you're going to be wishing that you did get it done. So, <clears throat> if uh, if it's reported, and to do with the brakes, your best to get it get it sorted. All right, want to crack on and get it sorted. Okay.